Yeah, one of the things we did, it was last fall, we actually brought out our 4K product, uh, which is basically the first solid state media player that allows you to display 4K content. And this was a real breakthrough for the industry because up to that point, there was really no devices on the market that would allow you to display 4K content. Well, there's three big things that really separate us from everyone else in the 4K market. So um, the first thing is when you look at what's called time resolution or how many frames per second, our player plays 60 frames a second, which is what our eyes are really used to because at 60 frames per second, everything looks smooth. And when you have 30 frames a second, you see kind of a jitter or kind of a stutter in there. So by having 60 frames a second, it looks very smooth and you see that nice resolution, it makes it come to life. And then the second one is the ability of using this new compression technology called H.265. And it allows you to have the same file sizes that you would have for 1080 content with 4K. So even though you have four times as many pixels, it's the same file size. And then the third one, which is really an older technology that no one took advantage of, but in the new standard is, is 8-bit versus 10-bit. So going from 255 colors to 1024 colors makes a dramatic difference in when you look at colors on the screen. And mostly when you see kind of smooth color, a lot of times you'll notice on television, which is 8-bit today, you'll see banding of the color. And the 10-bit takes that out of the picture and makes it very smooth. And last but not least is, you know, kind of the bright sign quality, high quality solid state media players that have super low failure rates. So it doesn't suffer from a lot of the moving parts and kind of high energy consumption that PCs do. The value of, of the integrators is going to be improved image quality. There's been lots of studies done that the higher the image quality, the more time that people look at displays and the longer time they will stay looking at them. So the ability to get your message out there as the image quality improves, you get more people looking at it. So that's the first step. The second step will be the longevity of the technology. If you look at where technology is going, if someone said, oh, do you want to buy a 720p television today? You'd be like, no way, I don't want a 720p television. Same thing is going to be happening in 4K. 1080p is there today, but 4K is on the market. In a year from now, most people are just going to be required part of 4K. So the longevity of the technology, you'd hate to put a new installation in today and feel like in a year from now that it's, quote, old technology. So our website has tons of information, has tutorials, demo content, and it's www.brightsign, B-R-I-G-H-T-S-I-G-N, Dot B -I -Z. Or the other way is go to Google, type in Bright Sign, and we'll be the first website you'll go to.